Hey guys, it's Kim Dai here. Welcome back to my vlog channel. I am heading off to the airport now to fly to South Korea. So I think I've got all my bags packed. Um, I'm going to do one last check around this Airbnb and yeah, gonna take the taxi to the airport. luggage and I just had to film some b-roll around the airport for Sony. Now I'm going to go through immigration, security etc and um, chill around the airport um, before I leave. Guys they have new Tokyo banana Kit Kat. That's amazing. The thing is I don't really like banana so I wouldn't get that but they have this one. This one's new. Um, Kyobo grape. So I feel like I would like this one. But yeah, I just don't want to carry it around with me. If they had like a smaller box, they've also got the sucker and matcha one, which is quite nice. It's sweeter than this one. This is just the matcha. You've got strawberry and melon. I haven't tried that one yet. So I was trying to edit some videos whilst I was on the plane but then I actually just fell asleep because I was so exhausted. Um, I'm just waiting for my luggage now and then there should be a driver that would be here to pick me up. So I'm going to go out and find my name on a sign and yeah I think I'm going to go straight to the hotel, chill there for a bit, take a shower and afterwards if I have free time Nick and Darby are going to meet me and then we're just going to chill together. Got my luggage and met up with my driver so we're going to head into Seoul now. guys and this place is amazing so okay I arrived at Gimpo Airport and then Sony sent a driver to pick me up to drive me to this hotel the traffic was really bad so it took like an hour and a half to get to Seoul but I made it and I'm in the West in Choson and this is kind of near Myeongdong as soon as I walked in the staff have been amazing like seriously the service here is top-notch I just arrived like 10 minutes ago and I was just kind of preparing the room to settle down and then I heard a knock on the door one of the staff came in and Sony actually delivered me this a bottle of wine two mandarins and oh what's this uh, beef jerky oh my gosh it looks really fancy <gasps> oh 
chocolates. Oh, it smells so good. So far, I am loving this. So anyway, I'm going to give you guys a quick hotel room tour. As you first enter the room, this is what it looks like. On the left, you've got closets. And I actually thought these were all drawers. I was like, what is all this? But it's actually just a door designed that way. So you've got a safe and you've got some spots to leave clothing and an area to hang up your clothes. Then over here, you've just got some more space. Ooh, okay. So you've got an iron, ironing board, a robe. You've also got slippers, um, laundry bags and stuff. That's great. Then this one's just, I guess, oh yeah, like... Fire extinguisher and all that stuff in case of emergencies. Then here is the bathroom. So you got massive mirror, sink, um, soap, glasses, towels, face towels. There are the amenities. So we've got shampoo, conditioner, body wash, body lotion, toothbrush, sanitary bags, comb, Vanity kit, shaving kit, and shower cap. There's a toilet, then here is the shower. And oh, I got a bathrobe at the back. Oh, that's my phone, let me grab that. Now coming into the bedroom, so it's very spacious. I have a massive king size bed with like five pillows. So that's gonna be ah, so good. I'm gonna have such a good sleep tonight. Then over to the left, just my luggage. You got a big TV. Then in here, I have kettle. Oh, you've got these cups to put your coffee in. That's cool. Never seen that before in a hotel. Teas. Um, I'm actually going to go down and buy some coffee at a convenience store because you guys know me. I don't like drinking good coffee. I like drinking bad coffee. You've got some snacks, but this is going to cost you. So, wow. I like Pringles. It's like $6. The beef jerky is 11,000 won. Whoa. So this one here, that's like $11 for that. That is the fridge with lots of drinks in there. But if you take any of these, then it's going to cost you as well. So let's just not touch that. Then up here, we have an espresso machine and then water. So I'm going to grab this because these ones are free. I have a desk here where I can do my editing. Another big mirror. Then over here just you've got a panel to control the lights um room service a couch a small coffee table then here is the view so i have a corner room so it's really bright from one window and then this window that's the view the view isn't like amazing, but hey, this hotel is pretty good so far. I'm loving it. Every time I fly, like my hair just gets really greasy and yuck. So yeah, W and Nick are going to be coming over. I actually sent them a picture of this and I was like, hey guys, I got a bottle of wine. I don't really drink because I'm actually allergic to alcohol. Um, if I drink any wines or any alcohols with fruit preservatives in it, then like I turn lobster red and I get really itchy. So yeah, I just kind of stay away from alcohol because of that. So yeah, I texted the guys, I sent them a picture and I was like, hey guys, I got a bottle of wine. You guys can come in and enjoy the wine and I'll eat the chocolate and mandarins. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna go take a shower now guys. Guys, so I took a shower and I'm now with Dabi and Nick and we're just gonna get some dinner. I'm gonna go here but we have to wait. Because we have to wait for the restaurant, I found a GS25 so I'm gonna buy my bad coffee. Yeah, these ones here. Oh, oh those ones. That one up there is my favourite. Pretty much buying the whole stash. That was so good. I'm gonna get some food. So I'm with Nick and Dabi and we are gonna get some sun up so.
We finished dinner, now we are going to head into an olive young because I have to buy some more batteries for my feet. Oh, face masks. I did this one once and it just hurt so much. Hurt? Yeah, it hurt. stung my face, that one there. I don't know if it's, if it's meant to. Harry Para have new colours. Oh, I'm going to test those out in a sec. Oh, it's so pretty. Just going to buy these band-aids. It's just so tempting to look at makeup every time you are in Korea. That looks like a really pretty palette. Very shimmery though. Oh, look at that, so pigmented and creamy. This color is so pretty. It's a darker one. I think I'm gonna get one. This is the new collection. I said I wouldn't get anything, but like, I couldn't help myself. These two are so pretty. These are two new colors from Peri Para. I'm gonna pick up a new eyeliner as well. This one here, the Kill Black because the eyeliners I bought with me to Japan um, or on this trip dried out <laughs> so need a new one Hey guys, I am now back in the hotel room, though no, I've been back here for about two hours now. So uh, Nick and David dropped me off at my hotel after we went to Olive Young. And then I caught up with Eric on the phone for about an hour. And then I just had to do some catching up um, with some work. So yeah, now it is time for bed. I kind of have a headache and I think it's because of the air. Sometimes when the air pollution is quite bad in Korea, whenever I go out, I get headaches. So um, I've got a little bit of a migraine, but I'm going to go to bed and hopefully I can sleep it off. Um, but I want to show you guys what I got today. So first off, I went to a convenience store. I think it was just a GS25 and I bought a bunch of these coffees. These are the coffees that I always drink every time I come to Korea because it's so good. It's really cheap. It's like a dollar per can and okay it's the stuff that I like. If you like good coffee then you'll hate those. Um, I also went to Olive Young to pick up some stuff. So first off I got some band-aids because once again my foot, um, the eczema is just getting really bad and I don't know how to fix it. And I think it's because some of the band-aids I bought in Japan weren't good quality and they keep on rubbing off making my uh, foot worse. So I got these waterproof ones and hopefully they will stay on my feet and um, hopefully my foot recovers. Um, I also got a new eyeliner. Um, I also picked up two of the new ink velvets and I got it in Heart Fuchsia and Star Plum. Yeah, I love that color. Oh, it's so nice. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this video here because it's 11 p.m. and I really need to get to sleep so I can wake up early tomorrow. Um, I have to get down to the lobby at 8 a.m. to meet up with the Sony staff. So I'm going to try and wake up at 6 a.m. to get ready. So yeah, if I sleep now, then I can get at least seven hours sleep. Tomorrow will be day one of the Sony trip. So I'm really excited for this. I actually don't know the itinerary. So Sony has told me um, or told my manager that they have lots of things planned we've got some cultural things and also some nature so i'm just really excited to meet everyone anyway i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video thank you so much guys for watching sorry that um i guess my japan vlogs weren't as detailed as i would have hoped um but hopefully these korea vlogs will be um really enjoyable so see you tomorrow guys bye